When I had awakened from my slumber on a cold November morning, I had not realized the change that had taken place. It was finally fall, and there were leaves all over the ground. Hello everybody, it's Millie, and today, I will not be building today. But don't worry, I'll explain everything. But first, let me show off some new additions. First thing, I built a swing in front of my froggy house. It's a nice way to just sit and chill, look at the ocean, even though I can't see the ocean from here. I also added some eyelashes to my frog because I wanted to be a girl frog. And I thought it would look really cute if it had eyelashes. My most favorite addition of them all is this uh, storage area. I made it look like weird core. You heard a weird core? It's really nice looking, but it's also kind of creepy. Got the black void and then I have some moss leading into it. Checkered floor for the liminal effect. And I basically just labeled all of the chests and stuff. Because I was tired of how uh, my storage looked before. When it was all clumped up against here, none of my blocks were organized. But now, everything is organized. And also, I added this uh, wall of coordinates. So now I know the places I can go. Like the hub area. I'll be honest, I have not been back to the club hub area. Only because I have no idea where it is. And every time I try to go there, I get lost and end up dying. That's why uh, I journeyed there and I wrote down the coordinates. So I don't forget. Now onto the tasks that I have for myself today. First things first, I really want to break down this uh, spruce because it, it's an eyesore. It does not blend in. All these, everything around here is orange and the spruce leaves are still brown, brown, not brown, green. And it's just very ugly. And I wanted to get rid of this, probably move the sapling somewhere else or just not replant them at all. And then the other thing is to mine for some iron. I actually found a uh, cave. It's not too far from here. So I will uh, be going there later on in this video. And then last but not least is to move that portal. I think I might move it closer. I might even put it in here where the void is. But we'll see how we'll see how that goes when we get there. But the first task is to break the wood. Let me see if I can get another axe out of here. Oh, I already have one in my inventory. Let's get started breaking that wood. Let's get it cut down because it's an eyesore. Did I just break that? Good. It took me about a full Minecraft day to break down these trees, but I have to say that it, it, was, it was a relief not having all of that in front of my house anymore. And then maybe in between the episodes, I'll plant some oak and birch in front of my house. As I was breaking the floating leaves, not only did I realize it was sunset, but that my hunger bar was low. So I decided to go inside and eat and go to sleep for the night. Okay, so it's the next day and I finished with the trees. As you can see, the uh, leaves are falling. And now it is time to go mining because while I was building this storage area, I realized that my iron game is weak. I don't like got our iron nuggets and I can't even make nothing out of that besides some lanterns. So the plan is to go to that cave and come back with about a stack of iron so i'm just going to make a ton of torches and essentially be just be very prepared to go in a cave 64 that should be enough and come back with a lot of stuff mostly iron wow the it's breaking pretty fast I'm not even gonna bother picking up the saplings so the cave is this way i remember it being to the east of my house yeah there it is and if you remember in Millie Land episode 1.5 this was actually the cave that I jumped down and while I was exploring that cave I found a mine shaft in here so I think I'm gonna also explore that mine shaft because I didn't before I don't need copper but I do see some iron so I'm gonna make my way over there right now after I get out this water That didn't work. 
It's okay, I... It's okay. But I should have brought some blocks. Because, oh my goodness. There. The things you do for iron. Might as well snag up some of this coal as well. Oh my gosh! <gasps> that water saved my life. Well, we might as well go down. There's probably more coal down here. Oh, and this is the mine shaft I was talking about. Ah! <gasps> no way! I wasn't even up that high! Okay. Okay, I'm trying to light up this area. Oh gosh, don't want to fall again. It is insanely dark. Oh my gosh, no! Not again! Not again. I don't want to die again! Where are you? Running down the waterfall. That's what I'm doing. I'm gonna knock you out. I'm gonna knock you well. Got him. Okay, before I died, um, I was saying this is where the mine shaft is. Oh, I got some rock cobblestone. Mm, is that enough? Okay. I couldn't go that way because there was lava. So I'm gonna go the other way. I didn't go far because I wanted to save it for when I was recording a video such as this. Oh no, I hear a baby zombie. I hate baby zombies. Well, I don't hate them. I think they're a fantastic addition to Minecraft. But those buggers are so fast. Knowing any moment he could just run up and get me. I just... Did I just walk in a circle? I did. Oh. I just remembered I'm supposed to be looking for iron. But I really want to explore this mine shaft. Oh no, found him, found him, found him. Come on. If I had my mouse, I would have killed him faster. Ooh, a chest. Yeah, I saw this, but I wanted to leave it. Got some coal and some rails. Probably for another Millieland ride. What's down here? Oh, another part of the mine shaft. Oh my goodness, lava. Did I just walk in another circle? Why do I keep walking? Is this is this where I was? This is where I was. Yes, this was where I was. Oh my gosh, why do I keep coming back here? Oh, I didn't even notice this iron. There's only one, but okay. Also, anyone remember the old caves? I mean, these are nice. There was something, but there was something special about the, the older caves, the original caves. don't know what I really dislike having um, spider eyes in my inventory I don't know why it just makes my inventory look dirty and I am really low I need to eat something iron just one again axolotl creeper axolotl creeper Good thing mob griefing was turned off. There's absolutely no risk here other than losing my spot. Wow, it gave me, what, four redstone? I'm not even a redstone person. I don't know how to use redstone other than making an automatic door. But no iron. <laughs> That's what I need. All I have are five nuggets. I need iron. I'm actually getting a bit turned around. I don't know where I've been. Don't know where I came from. Oh, ooh, that was a close one. It's dark over here, so that means I haven't explored this area. Another chest. Well, I'm on a roll with these golden apples. And some more torches. Always welcome. And I'll take the seeds, what the heck. Rails, do I need rails? 
I mean, you can't just leave the chest full of rails. So I'll take them. Oh no! Ah! 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 He came out of the darkness! Cause I was paying attention to that skeleton, I didn't even notice- Oh my gosh, diamonds! Okay, let me kill- Let me get out of this. Let me get this skeleton so I'm not interfered. Mind these diamonds. Well, we came in here looking for- For iron? We found diamonds. Always welcome. Ooh, four diamonds. Let's see what's over here. Oh, it's a, a spawner? Oh, not just a spawner. Haha, <laughs> you're stuck. Usually when there's spider webs, there's bound to be a cave spider spawner nearby. Oh, I can't break it because I'm inside of something. Stop trying. There was nothing here. Not even a spawner. And why can't I get my hearts to 100%? Or did I have them at 100%? Because every time I look down, it's at 4 or 3. That is also me. Hey, more diamonds! More diamonds! Always welcome. Wish I had fortune 3. But I'll take it. Back rooms. Mine should have back rooms. But that's that's the vibes I'm getting right now. I'm not really a fan of the deep slate. I'll be honest. That's what this is called, right? Yeah, I'm not a fan of the deep slate. If I have deep slate in my inventory, I tend to just throw it out if it's full. Genuinely, I I'm about to have more diamonds than iron at this point. So I think I think I'm done exploring the Minecraft mine shaft. Now it's just ooh bread. I love bread. I love bread. With this extra pack, I picture the bread tasting like a honey bun. It's just so glossy. And yes, I hear that skeleton. I need a way out. Cause I'm not. I I'm done in the mine shaft, but I'm not done in this cave. What happened to me accidentally stumbling upon the exit? Now I'm just turned around. Oh my gosh, jump scare. <gasps> These zombies are something else. I just want to get out the cave. I want to get out this mine shaft. I need iron. I came here for iron, not for the mine shaft. Well, technically, I did say I would explore the mine shaft, but. Old. Now I'm lost. I won't. I don't want to be in here anymore. Cause I'm by myself. Are you kidding me? This is nasty. Absolutely disgusting. I'm here again. I'm in front of that lava puddle again. I didn't intend to be in here this long. Quick in and out. But it never really is quick, is it? Found it! Found the exits! And now, I can... What was I here for again? Oh yeah, iron. Because I only have eight. After... 15 minutes in the mine shaft, I only have eight. These caves do really be dark. They're, it's like, it's not even 0% light. It's like negative one. Creeper, creeper, don't kill me. Thank you. I don't even want to fight them. They're so cute. There's another one. I changed my mind. I changed my mind. Don't... Okay. Still alive. Taking what I can get at this. Who is that? Who is that? Get away from me! Stop it! This is my cave. I'm the main character. Let's get my hands, Lord. 
Did I just run out of torches? I did, didn't I? And I don't have any wood. Because I, I thought I wouldn't. There's absolutely no way I could run out of wood. But I did. Three hearts. About to be zero. Got a sniper over here. Oh my gosh. Please don't. Oh my gosh. I only have eight. Oh, we have ten. And it's raining. You know, I'm just going to take that ten. I'm going to take the ten. This mining trip is done. There you go. Ten iron. Well, I mean, I also got the uh, ingots out of the chest. So, 18. We got 18 iron. I'd say that was successful. So, I'm just going to organize all this stuff in my inventory. Put them into their respective chests. And I'll be right back. After sorting everything I got back from the mining trip, I made my way to the portal to finish my final task. Breaking it down. Okay, so now time to move the nether portal because it has no business being this far out <laughs> away from me. Hmm, maybe I should break the one on the inside first. There's gonna be monsters here this time, but I don't think they should be too bad. Just break this portal because I'm not really feeling this spawn area anyways. Jump into the lava. We're invisible. Magma cube. Was that press? He saw me dying in the lava and he decided to jump on top of me. Hello, kind sir. What do you have to offer? Unfortunately, actually that would have been useful for when I was doing the pod soul, but I don't have any emeralds. So I cannot I cannot accept any trades. But anyways, now that we've broken the portal that is in the nether, um, we're just gonna break this one. And we're on the last one. Get rid of this bad boy. And we are done with the portal. We're done breaking down the portal. The storage room will be a temporary place for the portal until I get around to building a proper portal room. So, hypothetically, we were to do it that way. Yep, yeah, that would work. Um, do I have- yes, I do. I haven't used it since I lit the portal that one time. Beautiful. And honestly, I like- I like this way better, because it just- Ah, you just walk into it now. This is definitely my favorite area at the moment. Okay, a uh, quick snippet. I used to be really afraid of the nether sound. That one, because it got really loud. It was scary. Two leashes. Wait, where's the pillager? Not the pillager. Where's the wandering trader at? He's the one with the leashes. I hope he's okay. But if he doesn't have his leash, that means his llamas died. Or he died. Because it is nighttime. Maybe he was- Oh no! I'll save you! Fight me instead, zombies. You made me break my crops. There we go. Okay, so I've completed all of my tasks for the day. Yeah, broke the spruce, moved the portal, went mining. We will not talk about the mining experience. We came back with good stuff, but it could have been better. So I hope everybody enjoyed this quick little video. I will be back to building possibly the next one. I hope this video put a smile on your face. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye, everybody. Bye.